हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी स्पीड एंड डिले स्टडी वी नो दैट स्पॉट स्पीड स्टडी कैन नॉट गिव द डेंसिटी ऑफ ट्रैफिक हेंस स्पीड एंड डिले स्टडीज आर कैरीड आउट ओवर अ लॉन्ग डिस्टेंस एंड हेंस इट इज पॉसिबल टू डिटरमाइन डेंसिटी ऑफ ट्रैफिक दिस स्टडी गिव्स इंफॉर्मेशन सच एज द अमाउंट location and causes of delay in traffic stream information of this study can be used in planning and in taking remedial measures to tackle delays at specific location there are various methods of carrying out speed and delay study the first one is floating car method the next one is license plate method another one is interview technique the next one is elevated observation and the last one is photographic technique now we will start with the floating car or riding check method this method is suitable for two lane traffic in floating car method a test vehicle is driven over a given course of travel at approximately the average speed of the stream thus trying to float with the traffic stream now in that vehicle there will be four observers sitting in that vehicle that is 1 2 3 and 4 now observer 1 notes time at various control points such as intersection bridges and any other fixed point in each trip he also notes the amount of delay at each point now the second observer notes the time location and causes of these delays the third observer notes the number of vehicle overtaking the test vehicle and that overtaken by the test vehicles and the observer 4 notes the number of vehicle traveling in the opposite direction in each trip now in this case the test is carried out in two direction say when flow and average journey time of all vehicle is to be calculated in north south direction the test is run in north south as well as south north direction now if you want to determine the traffic flow then it will be equals to na plus ny upon tw plus ta where na is the average number of vehicle traveling in the direction of flow this data is calculated by the fourth observer of the opposite side test vehicle which counts the number of vehicle moving from the opposite direction ny is the average number of vehicle overtaking the test vehicle minus average number of vehicle overtaken by test vehicle tw is the average journey time when test vehicle travel with the flow and ta is the average journey time when test vehicle travel against the flow now if we want to determine the journey time of flow then it will be equals to tw minus ny upon q now that is all about the speed and delay study thank you very much students